two of our Disney World trip. We are getting ready to head out the door and get on the shovel, shuttle to go to Magic Kingdom. The sky is looking a little bleak. Brandon said it's a 0% chance of rain. It's Florida, so you never really know. This is my outfit for today. I just need to lace up my sneakers and we'll be headed out. And the hotel is really big. Mm -hmm. The hotel room is bigger than the others. Yeah, this is probably the biggest one we've had. Yeah, I looked out the window and I saw all of them. We made it. We're at Disney World. Are you excited? Yeah. I'll never get over how much like effort and energy they put into this place. The same thing like when we went to Disneyland, it just looks so gorgeous. Go wave and say hi. Wow, go wave, go say hi. Look at the castle guys, look. I don't think we go through the doors like at Disneyland. I think we walk around it. I'm not sure though. Wow. Okay guys, so we finally made it into the park. We are on our way to our reservation for lunch at Be Our Guest. We made it pretty early and I'm glad that we did. Um, it was the only time we could get in, but the park closes at 4.30 today. So it's eating at 10 a.m. for lunch is like the best possible thing. That way we have a ton of time to ride. I'm really excited to eat at Be Our Guest because it looked really pretty on the photos and uh, everyone says it's an experience that we should at least have once. Then. Directly after Be Our Guest, we have a genie reservation for the Winnie the Pooh ride. This restaurant is gorgeous. The only thing is, and it's not really translating quite the same on camera, it's dark in here. It is so dark, and it doesn't look like it on camera, but like I need my flashlight to look at like the words on the paper she gave us. It is so dark. But it's really pretty and I'm glad that it actually is looking brighter on camera so you can actually see how pretty this is. Our Disney planner, Madison, um, booked this restaurant for us and hold on. Okay, we just gave our drink order. I think I was saying our Disney planner booked this restaurant for us and I'm so glad she did. I do want to talk about like how we did this Disney trip and all about that. Um, later in the vlog because I had a few questions when we went to Disneyland how I like planned for that and honestly I didn't do anything but buy the tickets online we only went for a day but for this trip because there was so many moving parts I did use a Disney planner I'll put her information below because she booked our restaurant she booked our rides like everything but yeah this restaurant was um, suggested by her and many of you as well and I'm excited to be here our appetizers have arrived I got the meat and cheese plate Sebastian got a salad. A tomato. Yeah, you can eat the tomato. Brandon has a lobster bisque. This one over here was melting down. She was so hungry because she skipped breakfast this morning. Is your salad good? Yeah? Look, wave, Margo, wave. Hi. Oh. The kids' lunch showed up, and Bash has chicken tenders, fries, and rice. Margo has the kids' macaroni, and we gave her some of Bash's chicken and fries. What did you order, Brandon? Uh, the filet. Brandon has a filet mignon, and I have seared scallops. There's a paintbrush. You can paint the cup and then you can eat it. Yeah. Thank you. Wow, thank you. Perfect. Thank you so much. because um, the Bippity Boppity Boutique is still closed, I'm assuming for COVID, so we won't be able to do that this time. Right now we're headed to Tomorrowland because Bash has been dying to ride the Buzz Lightyear ride. Wow, this is called Tomorrowland. 
We're on Buzz Lightyear and Margo is freaked out. Sebastian, you ready to drive? Oh, look at you, buddy! Drive the car, buddy! Tell Mommy and Margo to come on! We got grandmas in front of us! Okay, so we just got off of that Tomorrowland Speedway. I'm not sure how much footage yes. we got because I gave Brandon the camera thinking that he could film like Bash since he was driving and I let Margo drive our car. There was no, there was no filming on that ride. We were bumping all around. <laughs> but now we're about to get on the teacups. Are you gonna spin the cup? If you spin it, I'm not gonna ride it. But if you don't, I'll ride it with you guys. That means he wants to spin the cup. I'll be waiting. I'll just... They got me on the teacup. I swear, Brandon, I don't want to get on this if you're gonna spin it. I told him I'm fine to wait so that they can spin it. He's like, no, I want you to ride with me, but I swear. If you spin this, Brandon, right it'll. I'm gonna be so mad because I don't have to ride. That way, y'all can spin. I, Brandon, I swear. Thirty five. Stand back, sis. Margo. Margo just made hype for Barnstormer, so this is gonna be her very first roller coaster. She has no idea what she's in for. Here we go. You ready? Are you ready? It's her first roller coaster. <laughs> We're just stopping for a quick snack break. I wanted to see if they wanted to get in that water stuff over there. I brought changes clothes and their bathing suits, but Bash doesn't want to. We're gonna just quickly fill up on snacks, water, and then head over to the aerial ride. We're ready. Let's go, come on. Come on. All the way down we got a baby down. She didn't make it. She couldn't hang. Valiant effort. But Disney won. Disney won, Marco zero. Yes. As you can see, Margo's sleeping. We're about to jump on into Small World. Um, I think the last thing you saw, I can't even remember, but we just finished riding Peter Pan. I'm pretty sure we were getting on something else when I last spoke to you, but yeah, we rode Peter Pan. And now we're about to ride into Small World because the line was only 15 minutes. Yes, baby? What's not working? The ride's working, we're about to get on. Um, but Margo just fell asleep, so it's like the perfect time because this ride's kind of long and it's air conditioned. <laughs> She'll get a good nap in while we're in here. We're at the Memento Mori and people are hopscotching for a sticker. Sebastian's gonna go next. Let's see your sticker. Let me see it. Wow. Who's on there? I don't I don't know if I know who that is. Very nice, bud. Alrighty. Yeah, we're gonna park our stroller right here and go get on the Haunted Mansion. That building is so pretty. Yeah, slide it in right here. Y'all, the lightning lines are the best. We're getting right on almost everything we're riding. It's nice. Is the room actually stretching? Or is it your imagination? This is my favorite part of the ride. I love this part. They're ghost dancing. That fairy looks so pretty. 
I don't know if you guys can see that. I was just telling Brandon, I didn't get not one like delicious thing to eat. I would never eat a turkey like here, but it smells so good. I'd like a churro or like some ice cream. Something. I didn't get any sort of like Disney dessert. A lot of people were saying to try the Dole Whips, but I can't eat pineapple. So that's out. And Brandon won't get one because of his diet. <laughs> so right now, um, we are headed to Aladdin's Magic Carpet. And then we're gonna go and try to find Margo. Look at the duck flying. <laughs> I didn't even know ducks could fly. Um, and then we're going to try to find Margo a Winnie the Pooh souvenir because she's been crying for one. And then we're going to the hotel to shower and change for dinner. I found a waffles and funnel cake place. So I'm gonna grab a little bite. I didn't catch it on camera, but Elsa was just on stage and Margo was freaking out. So we stood here and watched it from across the bridge. I got my funnel cake and now we're gonna go see if we can try to find a Winnie the Pooh toy. There's like a whole program happening over there with the characters right now. Okay, it's almost 7 p.m. We are, actually it might be after seven at this point, but we're headed down to dinner now. We're just eating at the hotel. So Disney World closed at 4.30 today for some event, which actually was okay because the park wasn't that crowded today and there was no lines for anything hardly. So we got through pretty much everything we wanted to ride, which is great. And so the weather and just the crowds itself couldn't have been better for the day we chose to come. But now because the park closed early, we have to find something to eat. And we just decided to eat at the hotel. We have all showered and changed. I have on this black jumpsuit and um, I got it from this boutique right around the corner from my, no, where did I get this? Actually, I don't know where I got this. Maybe it was that boutique, yeah. But it's just this black linen jumpsuit and I have my Charles and Keith slides on. And the kids have on new sets of clothes as well. They're both in pink and um, I think Brandon just has on like a gray outfit. You'll see them in a second. But right now, I've just been spying on <laughs> this party that's going on down at the pool. Everyone's in pink or lime green. It's a really, really cute thing. I don't know what event this is, but um, yeah, they all have on pink. <laughs> Mommy, yeah. Mommy? Yes? If there's a fire, you look at it, okay? If what? You see a fire, you look at it, okay? <laughs> if I see a fire, just look at it? Yes. All right. Let's put your napkin in your lap. Say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I love these no, lids. You just, you just Perfect for kids. It. Here. Yeah, you, drink. you hold it. Uh oh. Careful, it comes out. <laughs> Is that cold? Here, put your napkin there. Yeah, it's cold. It's cold water. Perfect, thank you. She can't handle this lid. <laughs> the kids' food arrived. They both have grilled cheese, fries, and side salads. And um, we just ordered calamari again. We had it yesterday, but it was like the only thing that looked appetizing on the starters menu. They dim the light in the restaurant. And I don't know why. Like, Brandon keeps like, Brandon was like, it's ambiance, but I'm so tired of eating in the dark here in Florida. Like everywhere keeps turning the lights off everywhere we go. I don't need ambiance. I just want to see my food. And Brandon ordered a panini. I'm so hungry. This looks so good. What are you saying? What do you want to say? All right. 